How to become indisruptible. Specialize, connect, brand, influence. Hey everybody, Quint Lears, New Home Sales. Dot com. Hope you're having a great week. Check this out. I got a new mountain bike. I'm super excited about it. It's a Specialized. Now I know one, this is gonna sound corny, but one of the reasons I was actually drawn to this bike was because of the brand name, Specialized. It reminds me of the word specialist. And it's something that um, I've always strived to become. My goal is to become a new home sales expert, to become a specialist. And ladies and gentlemen, we are in new home sales. We're in new home sales, okay? We're not in general sales. We're not in insurance sales. We're not in car sales. We're not in resale. Um, and the new home sales is a unique specialty within the general real estate um, business. And it's worth specializing in. It's worth spending the time, energy, and, and effort to become a specialist in your craft. And if you're gonna specialize in anything, if you're on the fence, why not new home sales? I mean, think about it. New is exciting, it's innovative. I'm, most people are drawn to the word new. Home is emotional, it's profound, it's very American. Think about um, The Wizard of Oz. You know, there's no place like my car. That, the, the movie just wouldn't make sense. Or if they said, hey, there's no place like house, it wouldn't have the same ring, it wouldn't ring true. But there's no place like home? I mean, that's what made that movie Iconic, that's one of the things. And sales, not a lot of people run from the word sales. I'm actually very proud to be in the word, in, into sales. And if you've watched my previous video, you know that I, the acronym I used and I've created this was service and leadership equals success. So if you wanna become great at sales, focus on becoming a great servant and a great leader. And how can you not win? How can you not um, do well if that's your focus. Now, a lot of people say, well, Quint, people don't like salespeople. Let me tell you a funny story. I actually chose this as my license plate. Nobody else picked it, right? My other, my other car was new home and I had a little pickup truck, it was sales. One time I had these people actually follow me back to my model home and I thought, what I get out of the car and they said, hey, sorry for following you. We just were curious, what do you sell? So I think a lot of times we think that other people don't like salespeople, but in fact, they do. I think um, sales is actually very exciting, a very interesting word. In Dave Stone's iconic book, New Home Sales, New Home Sales, um, he talks about the, difference, the differences between general real estate and new home sales. And he makes some really, really good points because what we do is in fact different, unique, separate from, and uh, I think superior to. So I have an assignment for you this week. I want you to go through your model home, go through every home in your community. I want you to find every single component, whether it's the faucet, the bathtub, the doorknobs, the windows, and write down the brand name. Are you using Lennox, Moen, Kohler, Whirlpool, Maytag? Are you using, what's the brand name of the tile? Who, who are you going through for lumber? And this week, I just want you to write down every single brand name. So we're gonna, talk more specific about what to do with this information. I know there's a lot of fear out there saying, well, Quinn, I don't want to feature puke. I don't want to, you know, I don't want to feature, um, I, don't want, I don't want to be a feature dumper. Well, in order to be a feature dumper, you first have to know the features. And unfortunately, there are a lot of people that don't even know the features of their home. So don't worry about any of that. We will break down the who, what, when, where, how to professionally demonstrate and present your home, but you first have to have the knowledge. So your assignment this week is to write down every single brand name, one to 10, one to 20, as many as you can come up with. Again, guys, be proud of your profession. Be proud of what you do. Work hard, stay healthy, be safe, and I look forward to seeing you next week.